Hey, welcome to Let's Roger Diet, everyone. Uh, I'm Gilles, and today I'm making some T slot covers for my RF30 milling machine. Tired of cleaning those T slots. So that is my design, and uh, so let's make them. As you can see, I've now 3D printed several uh, of these T-slot covers, and uh, I think it's time to try them out and see what they look like on there and see how easily they go on. All right, now I didn't uh, print enough to cover the whole thing, but just to show, I just wanted to show you how easy they go on. So let's start with a few. Uh, Now my design makes it easy for them to go on, but they won't come off easily, you see? Like, really nice. I like that. Now of course they can be cut to down to size to match your own bed space that you like to have. So that's really cool. There you go. So just like that, easy to do and uh, fits really nice. Cool thing is that it'll be nice and easy to keep my bed clean now and um, without struggling and whatnot and just be able to sweep that stuff off. So that's pretty nice. But if I want to move them around, that's easy enough to do. They clip into place, just like that. You can actually slide them around a bit There you go. So that's pretty easy to, to adapt to. And this is made, uh, in this case, these are uh, 5 8 or 16 millimeters, uh, made specifically, of course, for this uh, uh, King PBM 30 or the Rong Fu, uh, as they are commonly known as well. So let's just put on some uh, chips just for fun. There you go. All right, let's see how that goes, just like that. So if you're into compressed air, I don't imagine that should be an issue, but I don't use compressed air very much on my mail, so uh, just like that, you find with a little brush. Anyway, I uh, thought I should show you what I've been up to. So, thanks for watching, take care, bye-bye.